from WFSB. This is an Eyewitness News update. Hi, everyone. Thanks for joining us. I'm Kara Sundlin. Here's a look at the top stories we are following for you on your Friday. Police in Woodbridge are investigating after a woman was shot in the head with her child in the house. It happened on Raymond Road last night. Police tell us the baby was not hurt and the mother is in the hospital recovering, but is going to be okay. They have also arrested 49-year-old Raymond Sosa after he refused to leave the house. He is in court today facing a number of charges. Police haven't said what relationship he had with the victim. Norwich police are also looking into a shooting that happened last night while one person is in the hospital recovering. It happened on Rockwell Street and Judd Road just before 10 o'clock in the evening. Police say they found a man who had been shot in the leg. He was taken to the hospital and is going to be okay. We're told this was a targeted attack. A cyber attack is still impacting two big hospital networks in our state, and now the FBI is helping. Eastern Connecticut Health Network and Waterbury Hospitals are all working through their IT complications, but still have some locations and departments closed. This morning, Eastern Connecticut Health Emergency Rooms opened back up again. We'll have all the information on what remains closed down right on our Channel 3 app. Our early morning weather alert continues to go through this evening. We expect showers and thunderstorms to develop, especially through the later afternoon and into the evening. Some of those could be uh, strong, if not severe, wind gusts being the biggest risk, some hail in the mix, and certainly frequent lightning. A secondary risk here is some torrential rain leading to some localized uh, flooding. A severe thunderstorm watch is in effect for Litchfield and Hartford counties until 8 o'clock. The ingredients are there for potential severe storms. While we run the risk of a pop-up shower really at any point during the afternoon, most of the activity will have a tendency to uh, ramp up beginning around 4 or 5 o'clock this evening, and especially as we get into and after the evening commute. We'll be watching a line of showers and storms develop, dropping uh, southeast through Connecticut later this evening, clearing offshore shortly after midnight. We pick up about a half inch to an inch of rain here, locally higher amounts certainly in the mix, but this will help to establish some uh, northwesterly winds tomorrow, which means increasing sunshine, decreasing humidity through the day with temperatures back in the 80s. Overnight lows in the upper 50s to begin the day on Sunday. Sunday looking beautiful, mostly sunny in the 80s. Monday becoming more humid with the risk of storms again in the afternoon.